you by trying to get a TB motor 4060 can this is a 4060 can instead of the 4050 original Arman fraction motor but guess what it's not going to fit unless you flip the mounts so we must flip the mounts it's touching in this part over here the arm and the steering this column over here the motor is touching on the original motor's place it will not fit no even trimming or drilling nothing so you have to if you are going with 40 60 can 40 70 you have to flip your motor to this way in here it will be so we are going to flip the mounts and you will see same method i use always to screwdrivers to remove these three screws under the chases one two three this is your metal motor mount you need to remove it so after removing the three screws at the bottom you will find this out now it is out just be careful these are thread locked <laughs> thread locked by red one so strong so you don't strip your uh, screws just do it perfect pinch it inside very well and pull in pull them out. so guys these are the original this part here when it's upside down okay so the same screws are in the opposite direction but you need to remove the first battery tray in here this will fit in here do you see this so these are the original place of them to flip it you will flip it here old motor removed center mount removed and this side battery tray removed the receiver side this little part here need to be back but let me figure it out first so if you got a big motor like mine yes you need to do it this way so the three holes here beside the esc but you need to remove the ESC if it's big. I have the Mumbai S in here. And this will fit. So the ESC will shift from the side of the box, receiver box, to this empty place, old motor. I'll just clean it, wipe it, and put the ESC over here. Nice and shiny. Here will be the motor. Here is the ESC. We'll locate a new side so guys like as, as you can see i switch the place of the esc to this side where is your chases number and the batteries is going on this one tray i fit the motor mount as i flip it three screws down there built in plus this mount so everything is in the opposite direction now it should work believe it or not this is how you fit the tv in here <laughs> you can put which size you can put more 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 than ever you think this is the 4060 can so you can put 4070 easy 2.5 millimeter will not fit in the TB motor. You need 2.0 millimeter. I found these screws, same my, the same of the old screw length and fitting them right now. So the 2.5 will not fit. Holes in your BLX motor is different. 
they are 2.5 and the TV they are 2.0 cool either or the original central depth just make sure always your spool spinning freely no shaking no jamming in the bearing I'm trying to push it front and back it's just in the place sitting not moving be careful for that if you find it playing, add washers here or do some stuff. Just keep it in the right place. And don't over tight. Don't add more washers than your two mounts space. So fit it in the proper way. Here is the motor. I can fit. A 4070 actually here easy yes 4070 easy go there of course I want to thank my best friend Sultan Al Kash for uh, giving me this motor uh, appreciate it a lot bro the old motor is going to rest now maybe <laughs> I'll find some application for it is here maybe you can put it back here but that depends on you on your car weight batteries etc my motor is heavy so it's going this side don't forget your old battery tray put back each screw you took it out from and the two screws from the motor put them back in just in case you need them later and that's it for this video guys hope to run it soon and show you this beast